Hi there and welcome. I'm on integratingtechnology-in-the-middle.org. Today I'm going to show you one of my favorite feedback tools and that's YBUG. You can see it on the right here in the lovely pink and yes you can choose whatever color you wish. I'm going to click on it. This is great uh, for teachers who take my courses because if they get stuck out of the site or if they're having real problems and they can't use the support forms because they're stuck. This is how they can get unstuck. They contact me right away and notice what they can do here. They can add a screenshot of where they are so I can see. Record a video clip. Isn't that amazing? Add their emails, which is required now, but it could be optional and submit feedback. So let me show you what the screenshot feature looks like. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Notice, got it. Notice the lovely green check when you're done. Um, notice the pencil here and uh, the arrows that uh, you can point uh, to different things. Uh, okay, maybe this link doesn't work here, so they can point to that. And then uh, notice you've got rectangles that you can put around things and you can change the color. Of course, there's the palette and you can make it blue. All right, so there's a lovely blue. I just love the way this works and you can add text. All right, number one. Hi, this is just like annotations on a PDF file, but they're on a screenshot. Number two. How are you? Okay, I'm just adding anything here. But you can see how lovely it is. And of course, you can change the palette and have other col colors such as green. So if you want to add another comment, I'm doing great. Dong, yes, doing great. All right. So enough of that because uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. It really is. Um, notice um, we can also highlight different things. Uh, we need a color. Okay, and um, and that's also a feature that you can have. I can undo the whole thing or I can simply send it when I'm done. So I'm done. There it is. And now I can write my comment. I love your site. <laughs> Please write this. You can write good things too. Feedback doesn't have to be negative, but it's uh, it's used for troubleshooting. And the email, of course, I'll add my email. Okay, and then submit feedback. Please add your email. It's really important. And then I'll get email notifications uh, that I received and I'll get the message, of course, and I'll be able to relate to it. And that's what I really like about this. So let's take a look at why bug and how it works. So first of all, you need to uh, sign up. Of course, it's free. And um, I'm going to simply log in because I already have an account. So here I am, I'm in. I can also um, set things up if I go into new project. Okay, I can give it a name. I'll call it online courses for free. Oops, that's a s <laughs> for free. Okay, and then continue here. Uh, notice I'm the owner, create project. Notice there are also extensions, which is amazing. There is the link that you can copy and add to your website. But what I want to do here is I want to customize it, customize the widget. Notice you can decide where you want it. And as I said, get the color that you like. And you can see a preview, which is awesome. OK, so the position notice on the right or the left. I think I like the right. And then you can decide whether you want it at the bottom right or uh, right middle, top middle, or left middle. Okay, top middle. Okay, there it's at the top there. Use all these annotation and then you can uh, decide how you want things to go. Auto detect the language. Notice, um, yeah, I think that's a good idea for participants. And then the color here. OK, you saw what I chose, but you can choose the color of <laughs> there's the lovely pink. And then the secondary color, the font, you can decide on what font you want. 
and rating system. I like hearts. And then feedback form and notice um, what do you require here. And let me show you what I will choose. Now it's really important for me to get email notifications. So right now it's off. I'll turn that on. So the email will be a requirement and um, phone number, of course not. And um, title, uh, the name field, I want the name also. So let me add, that's a required. You can have that as a choice or required. Uh, what else do we want here? Um, edit screen recording title field if you'd like them to give a title required yeah why not and then um, feedback field okay I think that's um, it okay so I'm going to go into my other one okay now we can simply add it let me go back into my other one okay so let's go there now now the way I get to my other one I simply go into this drop down menu and the other one was called online courses for free and then I'm going to uh, customize widget and um, and here I want the email okay so there I've got my lovely color email field notice it was an option name I want the name and um, yeah let people think before they do anything I, I believe in titles you know what I'll think I'll just put the smiley <laughs> Uh, instead of hearts, hearts, okay, and add custom CSS. Okay, that's not what I want to do. And that's it. So notice if I go back into my site, let me go back here and into the feedback. Notice what I get now. Now I get your email and your name and the title of the feedback. Let me know if you have any questions about why bug and show me what it looks like on your site by sharing your link. Thank you.